This 1953 Dodge Power Wagon Rest Mod could be yours for $450,000. Welcome to HSR Motors, your ultimate destination for everything automotive. Whether you're a diehard petrol head or simply fascinated by the world of cars, you've come to the right place. Buckle up as we take you on a thrilling journey through the latest in automobile technology, jaw-dropping car reviews, and adrenaline-pumping adventures. Get ready to rev your engines and fuel your passion because at HSR Motors, we're not just driving cars, we're driving dreams. The custom-built crew cab will go up for auction on May 17th. Paying $450,000 for pretty much anything seems like a huge sum, never mind an old Dodge pickup truck. But before you decide to trek out and find a cheaper 1953 power wagon crew cab of your own, there's something you should know. Dodge didn't build a crew cab power wagon for 1953 or any year for that matter. This is a highly customized Restamod, and if you have some spare cash, it can be yours. According to Meekum's auction listing, this old truck has been thoroughly rebuilt and upgraded beyond the extra doors in back. A Cummins 2.8-liter four-cylinder turbo diesel sits underhood, connected to a five-speed manual transmission. Four-wheel disc brakes provide stopping power, while Bilstein shocks and worn axle hubs contribute to the power wagon's four-wheel drive system. It all rides on a set of gigantic 39-inch BF Goodrich tires. For comparison, 1953 Power Wagons originally had flathead inline-six engines with four-speed non-synchronized manual gearboxes. Moving inside, the old Power Wagon interior is dressed up with black leather bucket seats in front and a leather bench in the back. There's black carpeting in there too, and while the dash has an original look, it's decked out with retro-modern gauges and a touchscreen infotainment system. It also has air conditioning, and for days when fresh air is desired, the custom four-door cab has a fabric roof that slides open. The bed is redone with wood flooring, while the exterior wears a bright shade of red with black on the fenders and running boards. The big front bumper is also black, and it's crowned with a 16,500-pound worn winch. Specific details of the build aren't mentioned in the auction listing. Photos show a properly clean truck inside and out, and the odometer reads just one mile since the restoration. It's scheduled for auction on May 17th. Meekum estimates it could bring between $350,000 and $450,000 when the hammer falls. And that's a wrap for today's episode at HSR Motors. If you enjoyed diving into the world of wheels with us, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications so you never miss out on our exhilarating content. Remember, every like and share fuels our passion to bring you more thrilling adventures and informative insights. So, until next time, keep chasing your automotive dreams with HSR Motors. Drive safe stay inspired, and let's keep the journey rolling together.